Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Upper Comedy I'm back with another Dokkan battle video and today we are on the JP side of the game to go over the details of the five year anniversary that has officially begun. So without further ado, let's jump into the news and see what's going on. Here we go. So as you can see from this beautiful image on the screen right now, we have the five year anniversary logo in the middle and then the Gogeta on the left the Vegito on the right. These two will make up the dual Dokkan Fest for the five year anniversary. And I am so freaking stoked to summon for these guys. We don't even know what their leader skills look like. We don't know what their passives look like. We don't know how good they actually are gonna be. We don't even know how they transform to be honest, right? We know both of them will go Super Saiyan Blue, but how? Like, is it gonna be a regular transformation? I assume it's most likely gonna be active skills with voice lines but we don't really know anything aside from the fact that it's gonna be these characters right but regardless I can promise you these two units both of them are gonna be absolutely broken possibly the new best units in the game I wouldn't be surprised and uh, I'm just so stoked man I'm so excited now as you can see your boy has a lot of stones ready for this dual Dokkan Fest so definitely as soon as these banners drop I'm probably gonna go live do some summons on my own account here and then also do some videos some collabs possibly just a lot of content coming for those banners so if you guys want to see that and you haven't subscribed yet make sure you do because there's gonna be a lot of good content on this channel for this anniversary guys now let's go back to the news and uh, see what else let's talk about the events first so uh, at the very top here we have the opening movie which uh, did a really really good job of getting us hyped I mean I think most people were already pretty damn hyped for this anniversary but seeing that trailer with the Vegito and the Gogeta and their transformations really put me over the top and uh, you know what like I already said you guys already know I'm very excited I'm very excited okay next up we have a login bonus if you logged in for the first time today you should have gotten 45 stones the Super Saiyan Blue Gokus which is actually a really strong unit and also uh, I think a new red dragon stone which of course can be exchanged in the Baba shop for a unit of your choice and then after that we have some missions there's some daily missions as well as some limited time missions and uh, this one right here is some kind of campaign I'm not a hundred percent sure how exactly it works but essentially we have to complete some steps and then once we finish that we can all get 10 dragon stones um, but I'm not sure if it's gonna be like a community campaign or something else it's like a Twitter thing I can't say for sure so either way expect 10 dragon stones from this campaign right here and then of course we have the dual toe confest between the two units I assume that this is going to be the respective SSR images for each of them. And of course, once you awaken them, there's going to be a different art. I think it's probably going to be the art we saw in the trailer for the base form, Gogeta and Vegito. And then, of course, they will transform into Blue Gogeta and Vegito Blue with, you know, probably you know, active skills that would make the most sense, right? So that's a dual Dokkan Fest. It does say coming soon instead of an actual date, which is normally what we would get. So I guess they want to keep it somewhat of a surprise, but um, it's most likely going to get leaked, I think, or maybe they'll announce it during the live stream, which is happening in about 20 hours from now, from the time this video comes out. I can't give you an exact time because I don't remember, but uh, I will be going live on the channel when that stream goes live so we can do like a little you know viewing party together and uh try to figure out what they're saying in japanese because obviously i can't understand japanese i can't read japanese so it's gonna be fun it's gonna be fun definitely check that out once that goes live and uh, after that we have the dokkan events for the gogeta and the vegeto so uh oh actually this would be of course the arts for the transformations right there so there's the blue vegeto the blue gogeta they look really really good i'm really hoping that the dual dokkan fest or rather the dokkan events will actually be somewhat of a challenge this time because as you guys know man i've complained for a long time that dokkan events are just way too easy so hopefully with characters as hype as these two they'll make the dokkan events you know a little bit harder too maybe who knows we'll see and after that we have this uh, LR guaranteed LR banner where we can do a massive 55 
unit multi and uh, there's there's gonna be two different banners or there are already two different banners in the game so there's the ticket banner and also a stone banner so the ticket banner requires 55 tickets for one massive multi and everybody should be able to get these for free through different methods i believe uh, we all got some from login already and they can also get 30 from missions and then 20 from this new frieza event which we'll talk about in just a second so everybody should be able to get one guaranteed lr through the ticket banner and then for the stone banner it's 200 stones for 55 units and also a guaranteed LR at the end of course you can also pull multiple LRs along the way in that multi so um, I think it's actually a pretty solid deal 55 units or 200 stones even though the featured units aren't that exciting there aren't any like any LRs featured or anything like that um, they're still solid units that almost anybody can put to use and of course the guaranteed LR at the end with also a chance to pull more LRs in between um, definitely worth it. I think most people should feel pretty good about spending the 200 stones to get that extra massive multi. Of course, you can expect my summoning video for that banner very shortly. And moving on, we have the regular anniversary banner with the anniversary tickets we got from logins over the past couple of days. And of course, you can also pull some LRs on that banner too. But generally speaking, these tickets have been very unkind to me in the past so personally i'm not really expecting anything but i hope you guys pull at least one lr or multiple lrs through these tickets there is the baba shop uh coin exchange shop for the anniversary and uh the cool thing is they added the uh, global versus jp cards this time so if you guys want those units and i definitely want to pick up the bad man vegeta for myself then now's your opportunity in the coin shop and this one right here is the Red Dragon Stone. So of course, a selection of units from the Baba Shop you can exchange with your Red Dragon Stone. Um, they're all pretty good in general, all the Extremes the Awakened units. And next up, we have the Purple Dragon Stone selection. The Purple Dragon Stone is a kind of pay to play uh, thing where you have to purchase it with a stone pack. So not really available for free to play players, but if you're one of those people that does you know, is okay with buying sales and spending money on this game, then there are some sales right now. And uh, the main highlight is the 100 stone pack where you can get a purple dragon stone. And there's three of them available, so you can get up to three purple dragon stones. And the cool thing about the uh, purple dragon stone exchange shop this time is that they added some category leads and also some LRs to the shop as well. So category leads, I believe, cost two dragon stones and then the LRs cost three purple dragon stones. So if you buy all three of these 100 stone packs, they can get a, I don't wanna say free, but bonus LR on top of that. And if you were gonna buy the sales anyways, then it's kind of like a free LR um, you can choose from, right? So there's that and some new story events. So we have the Zero Mortal Plan um, story event with the STR Zamasu that most people are saying will become an LR in the future based on his hidden potential system. And it's like a top tier one that's similar to other free to play LRs we've had in the past. So I think that sounds pretty legit. So this Zamasu right now can Doken Awaken, but eventually will most likely become an LR too. So make sure you get him done. And uh, we also have the Three Saiyans Led by Fate event, where you can get a free-to-play uh, Baby Broly and a Kid Vegeta. Right now, they're not the greatest, I won't lie, but uh, they should get token awakenings in the future and become pretty solid as well. And also a new event called, I think, um, the Frieza Force Enrollment Exam or something like that. And originally, when I first saw this, I thought it was going to be something similar to Super Battle Road, or at least I was hoping it would be. But as it turns out, it's more of a punching bag style event where there's going to be five stages and for each stage you can you have to bring a specific category team and do as much damage as possible with that team so that's what this is all about and uh, you can actually get some tickets i think that's what talent said i think you can get some tickets for that 55 uh unit multi banner through this event and then we also have the Wii's training event and this one is for uh, getting skill orbs or basically the new equipment system um, the skill orbs that can be used to further buff your units so that's what this is for you can do it once per day for skill orbs make sure you take advantage of this and do it every single day 
And then some story events returning. So the Dragon Ball Super Broly story event is coming back, and also the future Trunks Saga story event is coming back. We have a new stage for Boss Rush, so that's another 35 stones, I believe, for free. Should be pretty simple for most people. And also a new stage of Infinite Dragon Ball history with the Dragon Ball Super Broly movie-themed uh, enemies. Really excited to give that a shot. And let's see what else. So a bunch of Extreme Z Awakening or Extreme Z Battle events are returning. And uh, Elder Kai Banner. So this one is pretty standard. Your uh, standard 50 unit multi, or sorry, no. 50 stone multi for 10 Elder Kais. Imagine they gave you 50 Elder Kais. I might actually consider that. But since it's only 10 Elder Kais for 50 stones, not really worth it for me, but if you guys are really short on Kai's, then it might be something you might want to look into. And uh, the hidden potential events will be available uh, for both days during the weekend for the duration of the anniversary. And the final thing here is a new Ultimate Clash or um, Dokkan Battlefield for the anniversary too. Uh, basically another 30 free stones for everybody. Pretty solid. And then the rest of the stuff is still available. So a bunch of Dokkan events available. Super Battle Road available every single day. Uh, the SNS campaign for one stone a day. And also three minute stamina refresh. Baba Shop sale. And four times rank EXP in the story mode. And that does it for all the events for the five year anniversary. At least for part one. Because as you guys know, there's always a part two with most likely a new LR banner, so of course we have no details about that, but once more details come out, I'll let you guys know, but that is part one of the five year anniversary on JP. Lots of stuff to farm, lots of stuff to do. Of course, the main thing, the main event is still kind of up in the air, which is the Dual Dokkan Fest. We don't know when that's happening, but once we get those details, I will let you guys know for sure. And one other thing I guess we'll take a look at is this right here. So as I said, for this banner right here, there are three ways to get the tickets. I think we got five. I think this is for the login. And then 30 is through missions. And then 20 right here is through the new Frieza events. I don't know the exact details of the missions at this point in time, but I believe Talon has a really good video out about it since he can read Japanese and he did all the translations. So make sure to go check out my boy Talon's video on his channel. Just search uh, Talon Dokkan or something like that and it should come up if you guys aren't subscribed. And of course, if you are subscribed to him, then you already know. So yeah, that's pretty much gonna do it for this video as far as the news is concerned. Of course, I will be doing a summoning video for that guaranteed LR very shortly. Expect that within the next like hour or two but for this video for part one of the anniversary that's all i can tell you at this moment in time hope you guys are excited happy five year anniversary to all of my jp players and uh, i will see you very soon in the next video as always if you guys enjoyed today's video then make sure to like the damn video and if it's your first time watching me first time to the channel and you like what you see then definitely Hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now. And while you're at it, hit that notification bell too so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media. Signing out.